New strategy wants to eliminate poverty, joblessness, prolong unresolved conflict, and social injustice. These issues are believed to have drawn people into extremist groups. The security officials say they, however, want a cooperation with all the stakeholders involved to solve this extremist problem. Based on our understanding of the economic root of terrorism and global best practices in addressing them, we are working with the governors of the six northeastern states of Nigeria to design an economic revitalization program targeted toward the states most impacted by terrorism. Working with various stakeholders, we are currently designing a regional economic revitalization plan. President Goodluck Jonathan declared a state of emergency in three northeastern states last May and launched a military search into the zone. However, the move has failed to stem the bloodshed. Political analysts say since President Jonathan declared a state of emergency, attacks in northeastern Nigeria has actually worsened. They also say Nigeria's military is losing control of swathes of largely Muslim northeast to radical Islamist insurgents who are killing civilians almost daily and run up to elections next year, risk aggravating the violence further. Elections are often violent periods in Nigeria and politicians have in the past paid armed groups to destabilize regions which could allow Boko Haram the opportunity to extend its insurgency towards the nation's center.